Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got an iHeart Revolution makeup collection video for you. This is my collection of iHeart Revolution Tasty Palettes. I have quite a few, I don't have them all. They're very colourful and cute. So if you like makeup collection videos or makeup beauty, that kind of thing, please subscribe, it would mean the world because I am working through my makeup collection. Even though I am decluttering quite a bit, I am also uploading declutter videos. But these are the things that I'm keeping and I absolutely love these palettes. They're so cute. What I'm gonna do is go through the palettes one at a time, tell you why I like them and probably swatch a shade from each of them like my last previous collection video and I absolutely love these. So we're going to start with this one. This is a tiny Christmas one. This is called Tasty Hot Chocolate. I really like this. I have done a couple of videos on this one when it came out a few years ago. Love the packaging, love the silicone design. Definitely going to get this one out around Christmas time again. Love the shades in this. Really enjoyed using it. I'm going to swatch this one today just to show you but I really like this. I think it was a limited edition one. I and I'm very glad I got hold of it and kept it because it's one of my favourite little Christmas palettes. Love the packaging. I'm going to show you the other Christmas one that came along with this one when it was released. So cute together. This is the Tasty Marshmallow Wonderland palette. Love the packaging of this. I do actually have some highlighters from this collection as well, but that will be in another video. So this is the packaging. Love the little marshmallows. Adorable. This collection actually did come with marshmallow beauty blenders. I remember those. So this is what it looks like. Lollipops, a gingerbread house. Love it. Perfect for Christmas. Just think it's absolutely adorable. Definitely my aesthetic. And again, I did do a video with this. Love this palette. I think it's very candy, very Christmassy. Love the shades in this. I am going to swatch this one. I remembered I really like this. The shade names in these are so cute as well. And if you want to see another video with this this Christmas, I'll likely do that. So please subscribe. Love the quality of the Tasty palettes. And this one's definitely my aesthetic. On to one from the coffee collection now. This is the Tasty Latte palette. I do also have a bronzer from this collection which I want to do a coffee latte video so if you want to see that let me know love the packaging of this really love the mint sort of teal green with the pink really like this and then inside this is what the palette looks like I really like this one this one is mostly shimmers but there are a couple of mattes in there I feel this is very perfect for winter I really like this shade here and they're all beautiful oh I'm going to swatch this one too so they're very icy kind of shades I feel like you could definitely use that one as a highlighter and I love my golds I think this is perfect for autumn and winter definitely want to do a video with this so if you want to see a coffee video let me know this next one is a face palette from the tasty collection this is the vanilla swirl face palette i've used this one so much i used it in my two million views video this is what it looks like little cupcakes and cake pops so sweet really like the highlighter in this palette and the blush they're so cute you've even got a little contour down there i'm going to swatch the highlighter and a blush for you to see so sweet actually really love this one that one actually reminds me of milkshake the daily blush that I used by Made by Mitchell so that could be a dupe for that really like this and I think this is probably still available one of the few that is and yeah I really like it if you like pink baby sort of pastel color blushes this is perfect next on to a more summery one this is the pineapple palette again love this one I have done a full video with it very summery love the sort of silicone design on it I think it's very cheerful I actually love this yellow this one was so much fun to film with love the colors of this very tropical and I think it's perfectly reflecting the sort of pineapple theme. I think it goes very well with the packaging. What I do love about the iHeart Revolution Tasty Palettes, the packaging really does reflect the colour stories, so you kind of know what you're going to get. I'm going to swatch this one here, the lime green, and then I'm going to go into this shade as well, because that one makes an amazing highlighter, and that one is so neon. It's not like anything else I have in my collection, and I really like the pineapple palette. It's definitely one of my favourites, and I just love it. I love it for summer. It's really good for festivals and holidays, so yeah, I really like the pineapple one. Next, on to the birthday cake palette. This is one of my all-time favourites. This is what it looks like. I have done testing videos with this palette and I really enjoyed it. So this is the birthday cake palette that goes with the face palette. Again, you've got the cake pops on the top. Really like this. Love the colour story of this. Literally so adorable. I loved using these shades. I'm going to swatch a couple for you. I love golds and that goes so nicely together. That's giving me sort of speak now enchanted vibes. Love this. And I really, really love them. They're very good for highlighters too. The lighter shades. Love the formulas a lot of fun to play with and this is definitely one of my favorite color stories i think it's definitely my aesthetic and i love the design on the front so cute next up is one of my all-time favorites this is the coconut palette i've had this for years this is what the palette looks like i think this was my first ever tasty palette love the design of it i've tried to keep it clean because these can get quite dirty with the makeup but this one looks to be okay inside this is what the color story looks like i have to say i think this is my favorite tasty palette just because it's so 
delicate and feminine and pretty. I just love the colours in here. I think gold and purple go so nicely together. Across the palettes you'll see some similarities with the shades but I just think they're made so well and the colour stories are so cohesive with the packaging. I really love the way they do it and I love that shade. Definitely one of my favourites. You can see the dip in the pan but yeah really like the tasty coconut and if you like pastels you'll probably like this. On to a little one now. This is the espresso palette. I think this is so cute. This is tiny. <laughs> I actually love the tiny ones. This is what the packaging looks like of the espresso palette. Again it's a tiny version of the sort of coffee latte collection. I haven't actually used this one. This one was ready for a coffee video so if you still want to see that please let me know. I think this one's all mattes as well so it would go really well with the bigger palettes in the coffee collection so I'm definitely going to give this a go. I think this is very autumnal too. For a little tiny palette you've got a lot of neutrals in there and very sort of cool toned ones so they'd be perfect for autumn and winter. Next up we've got the peach one. This is so cute. This is what the palette looks like and I got this I want to say a couple of years ago when I did the peach gift set unboxing. This is what the packaging looks like. Love the orange and then inside is the most stunning colour story ever. I love the purples in it, the pinks and the oranges of course they go really well together. Love this shade. Can't cope with that. Very princessy, very Rapunzel and I just love the way the colours all go together. I'm a very big fan of golds and I feel like the Tasty collection do golds so well. Look at that shining and I just really like it. So yeah this is definitely one of my favourites as well. I don't know if I've done a video recently on this so I might leave this out so I can do one. But yeah I really like the Tasty Peach one. I feel like surprisingly this is really good if you like pinks which you wouldn't expect from a peach palette but I really like it. Next up is the Tasty Avocado the baby one. This is what it looks like in the packaging. So cute. I love these as well because they're very portable and they don't take up much room in your collection so if you are looking to get a little bit of the tasty collection then the small ones might be a good way to go. They did do a full sized avocado one as well but I didn't get that one I just got this. This has really nice greens in it's got some mints it's got some lime greens and some really nice shimmers too. I absolutely love the shimmers in the tasty palettes. I can't get over how good they are they're just incredible. I want to go in that green. <laughs> so this is a really good green palette and I just think it's so small and cute and it's giving me Tinkerbell vibes. I just really like this and because it's so small I feel like it's perfect to keep in your collection if you ever want a green palette. Doesn't really go with many of my clothes but I love it. <laughs> Next up we've got the popcorn palette. I absolutely love this. This is one of the originals I think. I may be wrong. This is what the packaging looks like. I love the popcorn one. I did get this in the sale after it was released a long time ago previously. So I did get it for like £4 which I was so excited about. This is what it looks like. Again love the packaging. Love the sort of dairy milk purple. Really like it. This is what the colour story looks like inside. It does remind me of the cookie crumble one from the sort of chocolate bar palettes. I'll open that one now to show you. Oh it's called cookies and cream. I feel like the tasty popcorn palette is a more colourful version but these do look very similar. As soon as I saw it I thought that is quite similar but you get more shimmers in this one and this one is altogether brighter than the cookies and cream. In case you didn't know iHot Revolution do a chocolate bar collection and I have done a very big collection video with that so that will be linked below. But yeah I really like the popcorn palette. I think they're so cute. I keep swatching the purples just because they're so pretty but I really like the colour story of this. I would love to do a video on this because I don't think I have. Look at that one. That's so mermaidy. I just think the formula is amazing. I think that's my favourite shade I've swatched so far today. It's very mermaidy and sea foamy. Love that. So really like the popcorn one. I'm going to leave this one out so I can do a video soon because I think the cool tones will be good for a Christmassy sort of wintry video. Very excited. On to one I've not actually used yet. This is the kitten palette. Is it called Karaoke Kittens? Yeah. This is the mini version of the Karaoke Kittens palette. Love this. I actually got the lip gloss with this one as well so I'd love to do a video on this. Love the packaging. So cute. Love the pink. Pink. This is a mini one, so less shades. I actually had a cat like that called Pudgy. Love that. And these are what the shades look like inside. They're so pretty. They're very prom and delicate. Love them. Very sort of girly and feminine and ballerina-like. Oh, I love them. <laughs> okay, I definitely want to do a video with this. I think it's right up my street. Very pastel, very pink and pretty and delicate. Love that. So I definitely want to do a video. And I just love the packaging and the themes. It makes the makeup so much fun and I really appreciate that. And second to last is the watermelon palette. Absolutely love this one. This is so summery. I can't even cope. This is what the packaging looks like. Absolutely love the teal green on this. I love the reds and the greens. They really sort of clash with each other and I 
really like that. It's got a little nibble out the melon. These are what the shades look like. I really like this one. I absolutely love it for a watermelon. I think it's so pretty. Love the pop of yellow down here. Really like the pinks. The greens are stunning. And the pop of purple as well. I really love the purple shimmers for my Hot Revolution. And this is kind of shimmer heavy, but that's absolutely fine with me. I absolutely love them. Literally look at that. <laughs> I feel like I've got to swatch this pink one too, just to give a bit of watermelon. <gasps> love that. They're amazing. That shade again looks very similar to the popcorn one, but I really, really like them. So pretty. I love the shimmers in iHeart Revolution Tasty Palettes and would really recommend them. And finally is the iHeart Revolution Dog Palette. This is called Revo Pooches. This is what the packaging looks like. Love the dogs. I think they were actually representative of the people who work at Revolution's Dogs. I might be wrong with that one, but look how cute. I love it. Love the lilac. Very aesthetic to my liking and I love the palette. This is what the palette looks like inside. It's very cool toned, loads of shimmers, really pretty. It does remind me of the coffee collection slightly, but I think this one came first. These shimmers are incredible. Just look how the light reflects off them. For an affordable drugstore palette, these are incredible. They really are. And I love the layout. I love the themes. I think the fact that it's got dogs on it makes it fun. And I really like that from Revolution. And I actually really want to make a video with this this year. That would be so much fun. I might leave that out so I remember. I feel like my voice has got a bit croaky just ignore that but these shades are beautiful i definitely want to film a video with this just look at the shades reflecting off the light i just think they're beautiful for a drugstore palette you have to admit that is good and you can use a lot of them as highlighters as well definitely losing my voice that was my iheart revolution tasty palette collection i really hope you enjoyed the video let me know down below what kind of things you have in your collection or if there's anything that you've seen in this video that you liked from my collection i would love to know and hear your recommendations if you want to see more makeup beauty and collection videos i also do vlogs then please subscribe it would mean the absolute world to me and if you want to see more you can follow me on instagram that's at zoe glitter zoe with a y and i'll see you in the next video bye